Hey guys, welcome to my video. For today's tutorial, I will be teaching you how to make the single crochet group stitch. To begin, all you're going to need is some yarn and a crochet hook. For this tutorial, you will need to know how to make chains and how to make the single crochet stitch. I have videos on both of those and I will have them listed down below. Starting from the very beginning, making chains, you're going to make chains in the multiple of 4 plus 2. I have already made 22 chains on my hook. To start row 1, make 1 single crochet into the second chain from your hook. Make 2 chains, 1, 2, and then make 1 single crochet into that same chain as the single crochet you just made. So that's how that is looking. You're going to skip 1 chain into this next chain, make a single crochet by itself. You're going to skip one chain and then we're going to work this single crochet chain to single crochet again into this next chain. So we're skipping this one into this next chain, one single crochet, chain two, one single crochet into that same chain. Skip one chain, make one single crochet into the next chain, skip one chain, into the next chain, make a single crochet, chain two, and a single crochet into that same chain altogether. Skip one chain into this next one, make a single crochet by itself. Skip one chain into this next chain, single crochet, chain two, single crochet. Skip one chain into this next one, make one single crochet by itself. Skip one chain into this next one, single crochet, chain two, and single crochet all together. Skip one chain into this next one, make a single crochet by itself. Skip one chain into the last chain, you're going to make that single crochet, chain two, and single crochet all together. And that's how row one is looking. To start row two, make one chain. So for this row, we're going to be working the opposite stitches of the ones we made in our last row, and I will explain that as we go along. So we ended on a single crochet, chain two, single crochet group. Into that chain two space, make a single crochet by itself. Now you're going to skip over to this single crochet that was by itself in between these groups. So this is a single crochet into this group. This is the single crochet by itself, and then this is that next group. Into this single crochet by itself, you're going to make that single crochet, chain two, and single crochet group all in that single crochet by itself. Skip over to the next group, so we have this chain two space, you're going to make a single crochet by itself into that space. You're going to skip to that next single crochet that was by itself, and you're going to make that single crochet, chain two, single crochet, all into that stitch together. Skip to the next chain two space, make a single crochet by itself. Skip to the next single crochet by itself from our last row, make a single crochet, chain two, single crochet, all into that stitch. Skip to the next chain two space and make a single crochet by itself. Skip to the next single crochet by itself from our last row, make a single crochet, chain two, single crochet into that stitch. Skip to the next chain two space and make a single crochet. Skip to the next single crochet that was by itself and make a single crochet, chain two, and single crochet. So at the end of our row, we have this single crochet, chain two, single crochet. You're just going to make a single crochet by itself into that previous chain two space to end our row. And that's how row two is looking. To start row three, make one chain. This row is going to be similar to row one, but instead of working into chains, we're going to be working into stitches. We're going to be working the opposite stitches again. We ended on a single crochet by itself, so we're going to make a single crochet, chain two, and single crochet into that stitch. Skip to the next chain two space, make a single crochet by itself. 
skip to the next single crochet that's by itself and make that single crochet chain two single crochet all into that stitch skip to the next chain two space and make a single crochet skip to the next single crochet by itself make a single crochet chain two single crochet all together in that stitch skip to the next chain two space make a single crochet by itself skip to the next single crochet by itself and make a single crochet chain two single crochet skip to the next chain two space make a single crochet by itself skip to the next single crochet by itself from our last row make a single crochet chain two single crochet all together skip to that next chain two space and make a single crochet by itself we're going to end with a single crochet by itself from our last row so you're going to make that single crochet chain two and single crochet and that's how row three is looking you would now alternate between rows two and three for however long you want your project and that is going to be how to make the single crochet group stitch Thank you guys so much for watching this video. Please like and subscribe for more from me. You can follow me on all social media at Crochet Me Lovely, all one word. Please leave me any feedback down below for future videos and tutorials that you would like to see. Thank you guys so much for being here and have a great day.